with this. Right. And today's DVR alert, two contestants from HGTV's Design Star are creating wall art before our very eyes. It's a fun challenge you'll only see on PIX11 News. Design Star Challenge of our own to two contestants on the reality show. See the styles they come up with when we give them a blank canvas. Not quite sure how this design challenge will end up. Design Star contestants Michael and Nia have been working away since 7 a.m. creating some wall art and some rather strange materials are involved. We're going to reveal their finished work masterpieces in just a little bit and we're going to have you vote on which one you like better. Um, all morning long, we've been seeing them working hard on their wall designs. That's the challenge that we put them up to. Let's check in with Michael Moeller and Nina Fur of HGTV's Design Star and see what they've come up with. So nice to have you guys here. Thanks. Uh, we're going to unveil that in just a bit, but let's talk about the show. Uh, wh what was it like for you guys to be on TV and do this thing that you love? It was fun. I mean, you know, for me, I'm a super creative person. Right. And I but, like, like spinning but TV that. is weird, isn't it, Nina? It's a weird it's a medium. Weird. Yeah. It's another layer because it's like you, you're so conscious as an artist to be in something else. And then right. all of a sudden there's this layer watching you and yeah. you have to be on. But it was amazing. Did amazing. you feel like there was a lot of drama because it's TV and it's reality TV? Or were you just yourselves? Uh, I mean, being ourselves definitely. Was there a little drama? There's a little drama. There's always a little drama. That's why we like it. You guys have to look at each other a little bit. <laughs> There's always drama. You're going to put a bunch of creative, competitive people together. There's going to be drama. Well, this is a fire episode, a uh, firehouse challenge that you had. What did you guys have to do here? We uh, did rooms for some firefighters here in New York. Nice. It was really good. It was good to give back to them because those guys work really hard. Okay. Yeah. So we did uh, two of their rec rooms. Oh, that's great. That's yeah. great. And it turned out great. Uh, I got to ask you, who's your favorite judge on there? Is Vern really, uh, Vern seems really kind of tough. He's cutthroat. Yeah. I mean, I think that they all have something different to offer, and you really? have to go at it as a. Oh, any criticism is great, and you can learn from it. So See, that's good. Yeah. There you that's go. the key to success. Can you take yeah. criticism or not? Right. <laughs> you got to take the criticism. Uh, what's the biggest the lesson that you've learned from being out there and putting your lives out there? Um, you got to be ready. Good and the bad. People are going to talk about you after you <laughs> after you're off the show. They're going to blog about when you. When you mean like when crazy. they go in the confessional, take a single shot of me. Oh yeah. <laughs> I just met Michael. I just met Nina. I think and they're I interesting them. people. And you know what? The work that they did, it's just awful. How do you react? when somebody's talking about you like this in a confessional. Michael, Nina? You gotta brush it off. I mean, you know. I, you know, I, I think I said in a bunch of my interviews, I know everybody's smack talking me. So <laughs> I'm not gonna do it, but they're gonna do it about me and I didn't love it, but it's a part of it. It is what it is. And that's why we love reality TV. Exactly. We get a little peek into the craziness of what we're thinking and what we're not supposed to be hearing. That's why we're not supposed to be reading each other's minds. All right, let's talk about this wall art. Michael, okay. stand in front of yours. Nina, stand in front of yours. And uh, of course, uh, we're gonna talk about this. Michael, we're gonna start off with you. Tell me about your canvas right yeah, away. Sure, I was inspired by uh, an artist who's kind of doing graffiti pieces around the city right now. Neat, you got Shepherd some Perry. lace. Mm. Yeah, got a couple of shadow boxes on here. These are like trays that I picked up that you actually, you know, they piece them together. Mm -hmm. So they kind of are file trays and just uh, threw some placemats in the back of them, made some shadow boxes. What do you think that would be stuff. good for? These, like, yeah. these are super easy. I mean, you, I just hot glue these together in the back, put the wow. material in them, and you can just screw these right to your wall. Now, when you're designing this, do you think of a bedroom, a living room? Do you have any sort of... You know, you put them pretty much anywhere. What's great about shadow boxes is yeah. you can switch the objects out. So and if you get bored of something, you can switch it and out. And that wall that you created, do you think like urban, downtown, Soho loft? What do you think? Uh, yeah, probably like a, a bar or a lounge or something nice, like that. Nice, nice, nice. Nina, let's talk about your design. Uh, where did you take my hose from? What did you do? Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to turn these on for you. This oh, my gosh. This is, this is my take on Design Star 5. Uh, wow. And if you see, there's five kind of stems, and you have, like, the tension that goes on, and then you have, like, the fun, That's... creative pop behind you. Wow. And you have, like, the little moments. There's a lot of waiting that goes on in reality TV. Wow. So they hurry up and wait. So ah. this is, you know, and this is something that you can take if you have old clothes, you have old fabrics, and you just pull it in tension, you screw some holes into the wall with some drills, and wow, so easy. You guys are so creative and so <laughs> crazy. I just love it. I can't decide who the winner is. I really can't. We're going to have to put it on our website and find out who is. John, do you want to be the uh, final tie? Who would you like? Uh, do you see a winner? Do you see Michael oh, Nina? Oh, gee whiz. Oh, I don't know. Are you going to say it's a, it's, it's a tie as well? Oh, my goodness. I don't uh, know. I think they're all winners. Okay, thank you, John. Wow. And that's why he's an anchor man. Yeah, that's yeah, why he's Michael. an anchor man. <laughs> Michael and Nina, you both won this challenge here yes. on the Pix Morning thank News. You. you are both winners. But we want to ask our viewer who the winners are. You can log on our website, WBIX. Go to our blog and tell us what you think. Vote. You know, I, I can't I can't do it. It's too hard for me. Nina, Michael, thank you so much. And, of course, uh, you can watch uh, HGTV's Design Star on Sunday nights. Johnny.